So once upon a time, there was a young man named Kai, who lived in a small village on the outskirts of Kyoto, Japan. Kai was a restless soul, always seeking more from life than what his small village could offer him. He was constantly searching for the next adventure or challenge, never content with where he was. One day, Kai heard of a great Zen master who lived atop a nearby mountain. He decided that he would seek out the master, hoping that the wise old man could help him find purpose and meaning in his life. After a long and arduous journey, Kai finally reached the mountaintop and found the Zen master's humble abode. The old man welcomed Kai with a warm smile and invited him to sit and talk. Kai poured his heart to the Zen master, telling him of his restlessness and his constant search for something more. The master listened patiently, then handed Kai a cup of tea. Drink this tea, said the master. It is the finest in all of Japan. Kai sipped the tea and was surprised to find that it tasted no different than any other cup of tea he had ever had in his life. He told the master this, but the master simply smiled. You see, said the master, the tea is not what is important. It is the act of drinking it, the act of being present in the moment and appreciating what is right in front of you. Kai realized then in that moment that he had been so focused on the next adventure, the next challenge, that he had missed the beauty of the present moment. He thanked the Zen master and promised to live in the present and appreciate the small things in life. As he descended the mountain, Kai felt lighter and more content than he had in years. He realized that true happiness came not from seeking more, but from appreciating what was already there You see in life, in your life, happiness is not found in the pursuit of more, but in the appreciation of what we already have. To be present in the moment, to appreciate the beauty of simplicity and to find peace and stillness. These values can help us find contentment and purpose in our lives, no matter who we are, where we are, or what we are doing. This is Dare to Do Motivation Stories. Thank you so much for watching and stay blessed.